Benedict! Benedict! Want a cracker? Cause that's what birds like, right? This isn't like Benedict. I mean, he's like, well, he's, he's in the air and he flies around and stuff. It's not like him to get pinned by Varelsi. He's as slippery as a greased thrall. Maybe, oh, I can't believe I'm gonna say this. Maybe he was uh, winging it and things went south. <laughs> went south, that's, that's funny. Huh? Well, uh, anyway, if the UPR quartermaster did the job they're supposed to be doing, they would have approved our supply requisitions before we ran low on artillery, got overrun! You gotta think about where those supplies would come from, bud. Anyone we take them from out here is fighting, too. Yeah? Like who? Like the Eldred. Yeah, they're just collateral damage. Collateral damage? How could you say something like that? Stop sucking up to the brass, Monty. You're so focused on keeping everyone safe, you just end up making decisions that put people more in harm's way. Well, my bad for not just indiscriminately blowing everything up. I didn't say anything about blindly destroying things, but at what point are we going to go all in and stop in this war? All in shouldn't mean sacrificing the people we're trying to save. If we do that, what do we really accomplish? More than wasting our time trying to get a semi-flightless bird to trigger his nesting instinct. Right, Benedict? Man, I hate that avian. Look, bud, all I'm trying to say is, the longer we drag this out, the more the difficult choices become the only choices. And I, for one, can think of a million better ways I could be spending my afternoon! Yeah? Uh, like, uh, clearing out spider colonies on Oribon 7? Well, hey! It's Man Mountain and Comfy Boy! I got something stuck in this hair. Crawl! Man, I really hate this guy. I could really use some help, you know. Who wants to be my wingman? <laughs> Give that back, you tentacle freak! Yep, save them all, even this guy. 